There's a sign of possible compromise at the state capitol tonight as Republicans announce they're putting together a plan to support farmers. New at 6, Jennifer Cleasy has you covered on how this plan could fall in line with some of the governor's proposals to help a struggling industry. I've been farming since I was born. In rural Grant County, Derek Orth and his family are seeing the same troubles all farmers have been dealing with for years. We've seen lower milk prices, but we've also seen crazy weather. He's in Madison for Ag Day at the Capitol to make sure lawmakers know what farmers are going through. We want the legislators to know what's helping us, what's hurting us, because we want to be able to continue farming and continue feeding the world. And our goal is to provide both short-term relief and long-term relief because we know Wisconsin farmers need help now. On Ag Day, Assembly Speaker Robin Voss announcing Republicans are working on a new commitment to farmers as the governor waits to see whether they'll take up his eight and a half million dollar package of bills on farming. It should be something that we can work together on, but we would probably like to do something that's bigger and bolder than what he first proposed. It would probably cost more money. Than Representative Travis Trannell, a dairy farmer himself, says one measure would offer property tax credits to farmers struggling to pay their bills. That will uh, essentially put uh, money in the pockets of farmers in their checkbooks. It's hard to insure yourself to cover your risk when the prices aren't there to sustain you. Crop insurance agent Emily Johnson says farmers she works with need change, no matter who makes it happen. Whether it's a bill that comes from the governor or from the legislature, we would just like to see that um, they benefit farmers in the best way possible. Derek Orth is hopeful the lawmakers are hearing their message. There's a quote that says farmers, farmers have to be optimistic, otherwise they wouldn't be farming. So I'm optimistic. Speaker Voss says the new plan will likely include some of Governor Evers' ideas and some new ones designed to get farmers help faster. They hope to have those bills out by the end of the week. Meanwhile, the governor responded today saying he's happy to see Republicans moving forward on this.